Hello everyone, today I'm going to be showing you how to get to the Meteor hacked client. So what you're going to want to do is go ahead and go to the MeteorClient.com. I will leave a link in the description and we're going to scroll down and click on this Meteor Client 1.21.5. Go ahead and click that and it should prompt you with a place to save the download. Go ahead and hit this little skip button if you get this pop-up ad here. And then it will give you a jar file. We're going to go ahead and save that in the downloads folder. Next we're going to go to the fabric installer and just hit download for windows on this big blue button here. I will leave a link to that too. Go ahead and hit save. And that's everything that we need to download. Alright, now for installing it we're going to go ahead and hit the windows key and the letter R. That's windows key and the letter R. And that is going to give us this little window which says uh, run and in that we're going to type percentage app data percentage and hit OK. That should bring up the location of the .minecraft folder. We're going to open this and we're going to go into the mods folder and if there is anything in here we are going to remove that which is in there. So we can go ahead and take all the mods that are currently in there out. And next we are going to go into the downloads. So I'm just going to go ahead and run Explorer. And we can go ahead and drag the Meteor client into the little mods folder here and then we can double click the fabric installer that we have downloaded. If it doesn't come up as a little coffee icon like this it may mean you just need to get Java or right click it and go open with and then select Java if it's just showing up as a little white file which sometimes happens. Once we've done that we can go ahead and cross this off. It should give us a little fabric installer that's set to the right settings by default. Go ahead and hit install and we can go ahead and hit yes Create profile, OK, close it. If it doesn't work, just close the launcher and do it again. And then go ahead and delete everything. And here we no longer need any of this. You can go ahead and delete it. Now we should be able to go ahead and hit play. And we should have a new installation here that says Fabric Loader 1.21.5. Go ahead and hit play and then play again. And we should have the hacked client running. Alright, and now that we have loaded the game, we should have uh, Minecraft 1.21.5 Fabric Modded shown here with a little Meteor Client up here. You can use this on multiplayer, but I'm going to go ahead and abstain from doing that. We're going to go into single player world now so I can quickly show you how to use the client. Uh, now, it's a little different to the worst client if you're used to using that, or Horion, or Zephyr. This one, you normally press the right shift button as opposed to the right control button in order to open the hacks menu. So once we are actually in here, we can go ahead and hit the right shift button, and that will give you all of these little hacked options. Let me just make sure it's actually recording here. Yeah, I think it is. Uh, and to enable them, you just click on them, and then to disable them, you click them again. To see extra options, you right click, and to go backwards, you press the escape key. Uh, you can figure it out from here. If for some reason these little windows disappear, it's probably just that you've clicked something up in this top bar here, and you just need to navigate back to the Modules tab. That's everything you really need to know. Thanks for watching, and have an excellent day. Goodbye.